This is the biggest stage for conservative politics in the US. Marion Le Pen brought her own brand of, for want of a better word, Trumpism. Bonjour, c'est I want America first for the American people. I want Britain first for the British people. And I want France first for the French people. The niece of Marine Le Pen received applause for her attacks on the European Union and on what she calls Islamic lobbies. Her far-right campaign-style speech convinced those who discovered the youngest Le Pen for the first time. We need to convey our ideal the I thought it was marvelous. Vive la France. They need a French tea party like we have. She is absolutely amazing. She has the right idea, the right perspective on what is the problem happening worldwide. I think we all agree we're trying to protect our countries from, from globalization and from the Islamic threat. So even if we don't agree, we're aligned in the goal, and it was, it was great. There was no mention of a potential return to politics to fill the gap in the National Front Party left by her aunt. Marion Le Pen isn't the only European populist at CPAC this year. There's also Nigel Farage, the Brexit leader, or Sebastian Gorka, the former White House advisor, and American conservative favorites, of course, like the head of the National Rifle Association. The man who extended the controversial invitation to Le Pen was Matt Schlapp, the organizer. There's no question that um, we have been attacked by some conservatives and some Republicans. It's, what's interesting to me is most of the criticisms that have been leveled about Ms. Le Pen are criticisms of her grandfather or her aunt or the political party she was associated with and maybe still is associated with. Plenty of Republicans decided not to come to this conservative gathering. One strategist telling us that she didn't want to support Marion Le Pen and the French National Front in that way. Marion Le Pen will not be seeing the US President Donald Trump, by the way. He will be on that very same stage this Friday.